Good Saturday to you. It's uh, Patrick with the Oakey Shaver. I wanted to share another shave with you. Um, I got a, uh, a sample yesterday from uh, Sterling Soap Co. Uh, me and a buddy, we split samples sometimes when, when I get them, and I wanted to uh, use it today in the video. Uh, my first time using it, uh, uh, but it is Campania, which is a it's a region in Italy, uh, and this is a, a dupe or a homage or whatever you want to say of Aqua de Parma's Fico di Amalfi, which is um, figs of Amalfi, which is a, a town near Salerno, Italy, on the uh, what western coast, uh, south of Naples. Anyways, uh, this scent is, uh, let me see, grapefruit, citron, uh, fig, bergamot, pink pepper, um, I got a cheat sheet, hold on, lemon, um, cedar, benzoin, uh, it's, um, citrus forward, of course, uh, from the scent notes, you can, you could imagine that, but it's a little different, it, it's very nice smelling, um, I've got it ready to go here in this uh, Frank Homo seat bowl. And I'm using today a uh, finished peerless uh, brush that I got from Timothy Abernathy. It's got a synthetic knot in it. Uh, got it a week or two ago. Um, but um, I do have a sample splash also of Campania. Campania. And I'll be using a... Uh, uh, Ever Ready 1914. It's in this little travel container container uh, kit. There we go. Uh, I got this from uh, in a trade from Jack Bridges. I'll be using a Jim PTFE on its second use, I think. Don't see a lot of folks using the 1914. Um, I like it. This one, I've got a couple. This one's a little better example than the one I have. But that's how you load the blade behind the blade stops and, and behind the keepers here and the flips over like that there. There you go. Yeah, really good shaver. I will, uh, wet my face and get going on this. I've got a little over a day's growth, I guess. I was gonna shave last night. My, my son graduated, excuse me, high school last night. I was gonna shave, but I didn't really have time. And I'd shaved that morning, so yesterday morning. <coughs> um, but yeah. Stuff smells good. Looks like I got a little too much water, maybe. I think it's gonna be okay. Also picked up the bar soap, Campania, and uh, what's it called? Cigarro Blossom. I used that this morning in the shower. It smells really good. Um, both new soaps from Starling. I wanted to try. Anyways, here we go. First pass.
Hope this finds everybody good and well. Maybe if you're not feeling so good, you're on your way to healing up. Makes me get a bunch of rain here, it sounds like. This next week. Chance of rain every day. <laughs> well, that's May in Oklahoma. I guess not just here, but it seems like it's every year we get a bunch of rain in May. About kills your garden, and then after that, it gets so hot and dry that you're watering every night. But it's all right, I guess. more than just citrus this scent I don't I'm not a good describer of course as y'all know Moving on past two. I'm going to use a uh, 1924 for this shade, but I seen this one sitting on the shelf out in the bedroom. I thought, well, I'll use this one today. Which I'm sure would make Fuzzy happy. If you watch Fuzzy very much, you know he's not a Big fan of the uh, 1924. <coughs> Excuse me. My wife only cried about. already about four times last night at the graduation which I figured to be a whole lot worse than that she teaches at the same school that my son goes to or graduated from last night I guess I would say and uh, <clears throat> she's a kindergarten teacher I don't know how she puts up with them kids and then 
comes and puts up with me every evening. I don't know. Lord love her. Um, but every year it's been her tradition. She's been there, I think, 20 years. And every year, <coughs> she at graduation, she looks up kids that were in her class and she takes way too many pictures of everything. But she's always got pictures for all the kids that are graduating that were in her class. Every picture she has that has them and whoever else in it. She gives them the pictures in a card, which I think is a pretty neat thing. And if kids move, she tries to find out if they're close enough that she can drive and she's driven, you know, 30, 40 miles to deliver cards and pictures. Kind of a neat thing, I think. Pass number three. Here we go. Normally not just a whole lot left on this third pass, but it's something I've always done. Mostly anyways. Here we go. Here we go. Little sting. Oh, that smells so good. A bit different than the soap. Maybe.
Oh, I can't describe it. I don't know. Goodness. I know it smells good. <coughs> Not quite as much citrus, maybe. I don't know. Hmm. Anyways, it smells really, really good. Anyway, uh, we'll recap and I'll get off here. Um, so today we used a uh, half a sample of Campania that me and my buddy halved uh, with the with the, mat, with the matching splash. Um, Everybody, nineteen fourteen, also known as the baby ladder catcher. Uh, PTFE blade, second use. Um, in the Peerless Refurbished brush from Timothy Abernathy. Um, I guess that'll do it for today. I do appreciate y'all watching and, and sharing your time with me. It, it means a bunch. Um, be careful out there, and hopefully we'll see you next week. Lord willing. Thanks.